tour normalization is a key focus for USFK Commander General Walter Sharp. In order to assess what installations can offer military members and families, General Sharp is taking a look at what is available throughout the peninsula. Air Force Sergeant Jason Armstrong followed along as General Sharp toured K-16 Air Base. K-16 Air Base is currently undergoing several facility upgrades. A new multi-sport field complex, indoor pool, and renovated barracks are just a few of the new additions. USFK Commander General Sharp toured the base to see the progress. By completing these types of upgrades, K-16 can support more families and normalized tours, as well as other military units in the area as an enduring location. We got to have a place where you can get ID cards made and do the other type of garrison support. So the current plan is that will be here at, at K-16. So it's going to be a small location, but a very, very important location. About 1,000 soldiers and roughly 100 families are attached to K-16. Because of that, plans are in place to build a commissary. Uh, right now, until the new commissary is built sometime in 2010, the Athey uh, shopette here is stocking some of those uh, groceries, some of the fresh vegetables and meats. General Sharp finished his visit with a luncheon where he answered questions directly from military families stationed at K-16. He acknowledged there are challenges as K-16 develops, but if everyone works together, they can be overcome. Air Force Sergeant Jason Armstrong, K-16 Air Base, Korea.